is it possible after your biometrics after your medical uh would it be possible immigration denied your application and you know what guys i want to answer these questions hey guys how is everyone out there my name is sarah buyukan i live in calgary alberta canada and i love to share about life reality in this country i just love to share my life you know why not uh jobs immigration lifestyle my family oh gosh you stay with me until the end of this video today's video i just want to answer one of the questions from my subscriber he or she i don't know pinoy from pinoy woodworker the question is in tagalog pag tapos ng biometric and medical my case pa ba na ma denied so is it possible after your biometrics after your medical uh would it be possible immigration denied your application and you know what guys my answer is yes it's because of my uh for my uh, elder brother experience you know he was been denied he's in oh my goodness i help him to uh, i found an employer for him here in canada that, that was way back 10 years ago okay and i found this employer for him uh like a nanny i live in nanny the old pathway for caregiver okay so i did all the processing for him and the um he went to study caregiver he he finished all the requirements in philippines okay he have his biometric he have his medical he was been interviewed do you know the old pathway before he had to speak to the machine and he said like his medical was okay um his interview was okay so he's just only waiting the uh visa to come here in canada the canadian consulate in philippines took his uh, passport already so we're just expecting his uh oh my gosh we're just only expecting his visa to come here in canada and i'm just hoping they will approve him so anyway after all waiting for like months i think we waited for like one year you know the pre the old pathway before for caregiver you know you have to wait for long 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 months years so anyway we waited and uh, he received a big envelope a brown big envelope and uh, he said it's heavy so he was like nervous and at the same time uh nervous and excited you know because you don't know so when he opened and then his uh, passport was been returned and they do the explanation why he was been denied okay so oh my god i remember that day when he texts me you know it's very sad it's very sad when your application was been denied so anyway there is always a reason why when the immigration denied you okay so like for example um not because they do your medical they did your biometrics biometrics is you do the thumb mark right and uh they have to review your applications okay you know this is canada okay you are applying in canada so they will do all the review of your from your medical they will make it sure you are healthy okay because some cases they will deny you is because of your your medical conditions you know because medical is one of the requirements to come here in canada let's say your medical they diagnose you with uh something like contagious with highly serious uh communicable disease you know of course canada doesn't like to uh, bring people who are communicable diseases that can uh, cause danger to the public health here in canada for the people the canadian people okay so uh, they want you to be healthy to come here in canada yeah that is the possibility that your application will be denied because they will review thoroughly okay so after the review when they are satisfied with all your applications you pass your medical no health issues no health conditions then the, yeah they will uh give you a visa to come here in canada guys so i honestly asked that question to uh one of the immigration consultant here in calgary she didn't answer me yes or no yeah they, she just said like uh we'll just wait for the application but that's the possibility based on my own experience so that is just a quick video guys and i want to share my weekend just what okay Oh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Mine caught on fire. Yeah. Poison now. That's poison for you. 